for all our lives, America has been talking about decreasing our dependence on foreign oil. Well, we're at a, at a moment right now when homegrown energy is creating new jobs all across the country, powering our homes and our factories and our businesses. What will it take for America to increase our energy independence? More domestic oil and natural gas exploration, more solar and wind farms, more geothermal energy development, and helping coal burn cleaner than before. We need an energy strategy for the future, an all of the above strategy for the 21st century that develops every source of American-made energy. We've opened millions of new acres for oil and gas exploration here in the United States. Right now, American oil production is the highest it's been in eight years. But we've got to do more. We've got to also look at renewable energy as the key to our future. And we've got to build cars and trucks that get more miles to the gallon. But as long as I'm president, I will not walk away from the promise of clean energy. Under the president's leadership, the U.S. has reclaimed the title as the world's leading investor in clean energy. We've got more than 5,600 solar companies nationwide, and many of them are small businesses. Over the past four years, we've doubled the amount of electricity America generates for wind. The wind industry now supports 75,000 jobs across the country. But despite the Republican mantra of drill, baby, drill, we can't just drill our way to lower gas prices. The Romney-Ryan budget would cut almost all clean energy programs. President Obama knows those aren't the cuts we need. We can't have an energy strategy for the last century that traps us in the past. So I want to stop giving $4 billion in taxpayer subsidies that are going to oil companies that are making huge profits and have been subsidized for 100 years. And let's keep on investing in the new homegrown energy. That's how we leave something better for the next generation. That's worth fighting for. That's what's at stake right now.